Hi. Okay, so I'm taking this online class. It's free. It's um, through UNETSAT, which is the European Organization for the Ex Exploitation of Meteorological Satellites. Big organization. <laughs> anyway, it's a free course um, learning about the different satellites um, that they use and which are available to us here in the U.S. as well, or anyone in, in the world, basically, and how to use the data sets and which satellites cover which areas, you know, precipitation or sea surface temperature or um, ice, whatever, you know. So anyway, this is the... Um, this is the page, futurelearn.com slash courses slash oceans from space, if you're interested. Now, I'm just getting started, and of course, they throw up the glossaries first, right? And if you know me, you know what I'm thinking. Flashcards, okay? So, I um, go to this one, okay, and I go into Excel. I import it in through data from web if you need more instructions. I did do a video on that earlier on a few months ago, okay? So now I want to delete all these empty rows in between, okay? So first I have to highlight the data range, which there's quite a bit. This is going to be a good flashcard set, huh? Let me tell you. <laughs> Okay, we're almost to the end, and there we go. Uh, that's a little bit extra information there. And it's only in the one column, so we go over here to find and select, and we go to special, and we want to select all the planks. Hit OK, go up here to delete, delete she rows. Aha! Uh -huh. Voila, right? Okay, now what we want to do, move every other row over, right? You know what I'm saying? So to make it easy and to double check and make sure it's working, I'm going to, what's in cell A1 over to B1, and what's in cell A2 over to C1, okay? Now to do that, in B1 we put in a formula, so we start with our equal sign. If, okay, is odd, and we are talking about row A1, okay? Then we want to um, put row A1 here in B1. Otherwise, we want to leave it blank. And voila, it worked. Now, for row C1, we want to put a formula again, so equals if, now is even, okay? And we are talking about row A2. And then we want to put row A2 here in C1. Otherwise, leave it blank. And it works. So to copy those down, you, if you remember your short keyboard shortcuts, you go to the lower right-hand corner, get your plus sign, double click, and voila. Same thing for C1. Okay, so I, I hid the first column, and now I want to go through and delete all the blanks. So I select the data range, which covers two columns now. And yes, it's still a rather large set of data. And we're going to go over here, find and select, go to special, click blank, say OK, and it says no cells were found. And that is because we have formulas in our blanks. So we're going to use the mod uh, formula. So we're going to say mod and row, and this is T1. If it is, and we're going to give it a parameter of 2. Okay, and it assigns a value of 1. Okay, so we're going to double click. And we see every other row is either a one or a zero. So we want to select, we want to delete these zero rows, right? So what we're going to do is go over here to sort and filter. We're going to say filter. It throws up this um, drop down menu. So we're going to deselect one and we're going to select the zeros. Okay? And we can then just go up here and delete. Okay? 
or a better way I found is to go up here to filter and let's select all our ones and deselect the zeros. Okay, and there is our comma um, delimited file that we can upload after we delete this D column into our, you know, for preferred flashcard program. So, hope you enjoyed these little shortcuts. Thanks for watching.